Hey guys, welcome back to another video. This one we are going after every single bush travel form in AQ3D. If you guys enjoyed this video, do me a favor and tap that like button, smash the subscribe, and turn on the notifications so you don't miss any of my uploads. First place you're going is Green Guard Forest. And once here, you're going to be heading this direction. And right into here. Next, you're going just behind the boss, and over here, you're going to be finding this chest right here. Grab the secret of bush transformation. And then you're going to be heading to the House of Oddities. We're not saying on this map we're going to be heading out the door, and then we're just going to be heading right to this tree right here. Tap on that, and you can grab the stick of wood. Then you're heading to Cicero's shop. Turn around and head out the door, talk to Cicero, and look for the bush crafting. Right there you can craft the bush root. The next location is in Frostvale. There is a bush that you can get in this location by heading just up here and going through this gateway. The downside about this is this is a seasonal thing. This is only available during Frostvale. And I'm not talking about the location, I'm talking about the season. So around Christmas time, this thing will be opened up in December at some point, and then you can go through this gate. Actually, you can technically go through this gate right now without even having to wait for Frostvale. However, you can't go much further, as I will demonstrate. Let me just get up there, and there we go. I'm on top of the thing. Nice view. One of my friends discovered this but unfortunately you can't go any further than this this is as far as the map goes and then you are stuck here unless of course there's a way you can parkour out but i don't oh oh, oh. Ooh, maybe i did not think of parkouring oh there you go you can just parkour your way out awesome when frostvale hits you can head to this location and in the craft shop you will find the otanin bush now this travel form is actually the fastest bush in the game. It is rather tricky to obtain, but I do have a video on how you can obtain this Otanin bush. So when Frostvale hits, you can check that video out, and that will help you obtain the Otanin bush. Now back in Frostvale, you're looking for the magic bush. Now this is where you're going to be able to get the last bush travel forms. However, it is going to be costing dragon crystals to get these because there's only one way to get these well actually there's technically two ways but this is the npc that you're looking for this is not a very frequent thing for instance it took me and several of my friends at least an hour before we found this magic bush now it spawns in this location around blizzy so you're gonna be finding it in this general location spawning around here as it does travel this small area right here but it is if you don't see it when you come to the Frostvale map and if you come up here and you check and if you don't see the magic bush don't wait around because it's not going to be spawning in it only spawns in when the map is created so when the map is formed this is when this thing appears so it's either going to be here or it's not going to be here so you're just going to have to keep leaving the map and then returning back to the map as long as there's nobody else on the map you can reset the map similar to what you do with dungeons but it does take several minutes for the map to reset after you leave because there's some kind of cooldown so it's going to take a while before you can reset the map and then hopefully it spawns in the new instance but the bush has two shops in it now i'm not sure how long the giving shrub shop is going to be available here but the bushy sweater you can just get this right here which is a ugly bush slayer sweater this is because we had all got together and killed a bush that had 9.5 million HP, and it took forever to kill that thing. In the Giving Shrub shop, you're going to be finding all these travel forms right here that you can get. And you've also got pets as well that you can get. You're going to notice the currency is bushel of bushes and there's only one way of getting the bushel of bushes and that is from 
purchasing the Bush Faction Gold Card, which costs 500 Dragon Crystals. Upon obtaining a Bush Faction Gold Card, you can then spawn a giant bush which all the players in the instance can fight and I recommend doing this in a populated area so that you can contribute to other people obtaining a bush travel form or pet or at least obtaining some of the bushels of bush currency. The nice thing is this big bush can also drop the pets as well as the travel forms so you don't need to use your currency to purchase them because you could potentially get them as drops. And if you have extra currency you could then purchase the travel forms that you are missing. Some of the travel forms don't cost that much whereas in the other ones can be fairly expensive. But there you go, that is how you can get all of the bushes in AQ3D. I hope this video helps you guys out. Thanks to everybody who helped me with this video. And I hope you all have a great day. We'll see you guys in the next one.